amazing. I've got a standing ovation over there and a boo there, and I haven't even started. It's gonna be an interesting night. But you know what? <laughs> That'll never come off. <laughs> so, um, thank you all for coming out today to witness that. Um, <laughs> my name is Beardy Man. This is uh, my spaceship. Um, I've got some cameras on here, but I can't turn them on myself. I've got to get someone else onto the stage to, to help me. And this man's name is Mr. Goddamn Hopkinson. Ladies and gentlemen, please make sure <laughs> Mr. Hopkinson, who has at his fingertips the entire internet. I can see what he's doing on this screen, which the stage techs have forgotten to switch on. <laughs> or even to plug in. <laughs> Someone's so fire. Uh, can we get a stage hand on, uh, on stage, please, to plug this in? And in the meantime, I'm going to have to guess what Mr. Hopkinson's got on behind me. I'm gonna make a 
dude called the new look right now, yeah. This is what it would have been like if James Brown was a scold. Oh, let me hear you say, I approve. Some noise for the stage hand right now. <laughs> you know you make me want to. Water and cough up all the fat, the saturated ones. Yeah, I want to show you my arms used to be guns, but now the chicken wings flabbing about. I've had too much fat, no doubt, and I've got a low glycemic index. Blues. Blues. Nice to Mr. Hopkinson, by the way. Everyone. So I don't have you seen these shows before, but the idea of this show is that there's what is it, one. There is no fucking clue. At least I haven't got a clue. Um, I'm not sure why I'm walking this way. It's just kind of happening. I'm being led over to this man's haircut. How you doing, man? Cool, man. Are you doing a show? No, I'm reviewing your show. It's been so lovely having a career, I've really enjoyed it. It's been fantastic, so thank you all so much. Um, so what's, what's your name? Simon Price. Oh, fuck. <laughs> no, I'm joking, I've never heard of you. <laughs> um, no, so, um, <laughs> I'm fucked now. I don't know. Um, Simon, what's your favourite kind of music? 60 Soul, probably. 60 Soul, cool. Alright. I've got an impression, it's worth a start. There's a whole star right in my head. <laughs> Fuck, he's massive, isn't he? This boy's some shit. All right, this better be good then. So, uh, what's this song going to be about? Would you like to make up a, a song title? Oh, you can be it too. I'm sorry. Would you like to add anything to water balloon? Snorkeling. Snorkeling inside a water balloon. <laughs> That's fucking ridiculous. You'd like some laughing gas. <laughs> I think that might have been a review right there. <laughs> Alright, so this is a 60s soul tune about snorkeling inside a water balloon. Which is a bit what it, a bit what it feels like when you've had some nitrous anyway, isn't it? It's that feeling of kind of, you know that noise you get when you do a balloon? When it's like... <laughs>
it feels like to you when you're doing that just I'd love that style, that'd be fantastic. Um, I'll take that back. So, so, big up Simon Price, man. Come on. I love you. I think you're really cool and sexy and fantastic. How much money do you want? Just, um, <coughs> fuck it, see you later. Uh, yeah! <laughs> wow. Um, so let's, let's do another one, let's go this side, let's go this side. This feels like Challenge Annika. In a way. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, what have we got? Um, has, anyone, has anyone here got a favourite sort of music that they desperately want to want to hear? Them? Gabba. There's always one person asking for fucking Gabba. Gabba's this, right? For hours and hours and hours. So not yet, not yet. There might there might be a time for that. Oh, I heard dubstep. I heard dubstep. What would you like? Pet Shop Boys. <laughs> Pet Shop Boys dubstep, ladies and gentlemen. But I still, I still need someone to make up a song title. You've got to make one up. Someone over here. Donkeys. Donkeys. What is, what is that? Ginger hair. Ginger donkeys. <laughs> Ginger donkey. What was dubstep and what? Pet Shop Boys, thank you very much. Kids, don't do drugs. <laughs> the memory. The memories of the Pet Shop Boys dubstep All about ginger donkeys Ladies and gentlemen, um, I can't actually play guitar, I just thought it would look really cool. <laughs> so, right, check this out. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna do a thing, and it goes like this. Um... I was joking 
Christy, I'm not showing up, but I got to flex these skis, yeah. You know when people show up, yeah, it makes them feel quite evil. I want to get to know you, get to know the crowd. And when I'm gonna sing this, you know I'm gonna sing it out loud. Have you got a boyfriend? Yeah. Think you have? Are you a reviewer? What are you doing later? Yeah. You are. She's not. Then fuck with that. Never be really, really gash. Oh, but say I was only joking. Yeah. See, I like to be talking where my head is at. I don't really know. But all I really know is I like to suck my blow on the split. Yeah, I got a story for ya. See, once upon a time I was in, and I was in, I was in, I, I was in, I, I was in. Oh, that's good, no, seriously, there was a time. I was in, um, I was in, um, I was in Austria. Honestly, it's a really quick story. I was in, um, not Austria, Austin, similar letters. Um, weed, don't do it. This is when I did smoke weed, right? I was about to stop because of my voice. But like, I was in Austin. And we were like, um, it was, we were just, me and my tour manager having, having a zoo, and like, um, this all happened like so fast. And like, we're sitting there in this car park, we're next to this interchange, and he's just like, look, we don't want to get caught in America, that'd be really fucked up, we'd never be able to come here again. I was like, yeah, you know what I mean, you're right. Um, so we just went out, we like sort of laying low, and just sort of having this little zoo in the car park. And all of a sudden, this like white trash nutcase comes up being like, yeah, I'm smoking some weed! And she's like, what? She's like, it's okay, I won't tell nobody. You got a spare cigarette? Comes out like, uh. and she's like, here, give me a talk on that. <coughs> Coughs, the entire concept of the spliff, shoots out like a torpedo, <laughs> lands like over there. Before we even know what's going on, she's gone, oh, sorry, picked it up, eaten the contents. <coughs> and she's gone, you want a titty shot? <laughs> and we're like, ah! And my tour manager's gone like, um, I think I might go back out there, I reckon I could get a blowjob. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the truth, that's the truth, that's the truth, the story I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, um. Round of applause to Mr. Hopkinson again. Um. Yeah. So I, I think it's time that uh, I told you all a little story. Um, this, this is um, a story which I wrote five seconds in the future and it goes like this. That's it, do you like it? It's called um, Never Do Salvia Again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here's, here's another story. Well, I say story, but you see it's just me and I'm doing a rhyme And I've got no time to keep it going, going, going I don't wanna be slowing, slowing, slowing I just wanna keep this rhyme going, the way you saw it And I really gotta take another suggestion It's about time, yo, about time, yo And I, 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 I wanna get it right Fuck it, if you want to get up and dance, just do it. I don't care. 
I don't care. I don't care. If you want to get off the dance, this is you. Please be seated. The next hymn is, There is no God whatsoever. Religion is merely consciousness trauma. Go home and do not ever come to the church ever again. Sacrilege. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen, 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 gentlemen. I want to, I want to, I want, I want to take another suggestion. So I haven't got anyone from over here yet. Polka, that's right. Polka, I've got polka. Hang on, hang on, wait, 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 everyone quiet. Anyone from here? Reggae, reggae polka. All right. What I need now is you to make up a song title. <laughs> Rattlesnakes. All right. Rattlesnakes. This is, this is reggae, but silence. This is a game called Silence the Drunks. It's one of the hardest games in the world. Generally, you need big weapons. Snipers and shit. So this is reggae polka. Reggae polka called Rattlesnakes. Don't ask me why I'm moving like this, cause you know I think it just makes everybody a little bit hypnotised like a rattlesnake. Look into their eyes, is that a cobra? No it's not, you see it's not over, I've got snort. Hachu! <laughs> That's cool, man. Is it, who's, who's over 50? Yeah, anyone. Don't be shy. Don't boo over 50. <laughs> You'll be over 50 one day. Herbie Hancock. Herbie Hancock is over 50. <laughs> Let's do some Herbie Hancock show tune techno. Fuck me. 
<laughs> How the fuck am I gonna do this? Herbie Bangkok, Shochi Techno? Fuck, alright then, alright, alright, alright. Fuck, give me a second. Herbie Hancock, show tune techno. I'm going to get as close as I can to that bizarre and unworkable selection of genres. Herbie Hancock, show tune techno. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. It's like techno is a bit sort of like, you know, techno, 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 techno. Mr. Cellophane, Mr. Cellophane. Mr. Cellophane. Mr. Cellophane. Mr. Cellophane. 
saddle of fame. I fly to the thought of Spain, yeah, the thought of Spain, and yeah, the thought of Spain. I'm on my talking and the spinning game to the thought of Spain, the thought of Spain. David Bellamy in the thought of Spain. 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 Bellamy in the thought of
is to get this song over with Because I don't know anything about Top Gun I don't know anything about Top Gun And something tells me that I don't want to Cause everything I'm now saying to you Is made up of from the top of my head And I don't know what I'm saying So instead I'm gonna go Going on about There was a gun on the top, top gun On top of a plane There was something like that, isn't it? Wasn't there? I'm sure there was something like that. We're reconstructing Top Gun, reconstructing Top Gun. Yeah, you know that I've just begun. Reconstructing what happened? I think it was something like Tom Cruise, Tom Cruise, Tom. If there's anyone seen that speech that Tom Cruise did, where he really did something that was particularly weird, he stood with this giant medallion on his chest and tried to say that being a Scientologist was best, but it's really not, it's really fucking strange. And they want all your money again and again, they keep putting adverts on TV, and you know they're really fucked up, believe me, you don't want to be fucking with the Scientologists, do you know that? Yeah, now you've got the gist, do you want to be getting out of religion, because it's really fucked up? Up. Yeah, I'm beginning to develop an extreme anxiety When I see a psychologist on the street And they're really grown, grown to come up to me And say, would you like a free stress test? <laughs> it's really great, it'll help you figure out who you really are And then we'll take all your money, they'll take all your money And they'll brainwash you and that shit's not funny They'll take all your money, stay away from them That's Tom Cruise doing what he likes best He's really fucking strange and you know it's true You know that's all I'm saying to you What was the other thing that I was supposed to do? There was Top Gun and there was something else as well Oh yeah! <laughs> Scientology, Scientology, Scientology. Very high now, this show. There's a lot going on. It's really smart.
Good night.